Okay, here's uh, a couple of tricks I want to show. Um, this is going to be done with the four aces. So the first thing we need to do is we need to see if we can find the aces. So if I just cut right about here, we should get one ace. That's the ace of hearts. If I take that ace, I give it a little rub. I should be able to bring all four aces right to the top of the pack. Just a little bit of a static charge. Once you get the aces out, um, now you're going to have a card selected. So I'll just riffle down the edge, somebody else will stop, and then we'll give them the card that we stopped at. In this case, it happens to be the 10 of hearts. Okay, so we're gonna take the 10, we're gonna lose that back in the pack. Okay, and now it's gonna be my job as the magician to try to find it. I am gonna use the aces to help me figure out what your card is. Um, so in this case, we've got the uh, ace of diamonds, the ace of spades, got the ace of hearts, and last but not least, the Ace of Clubs. If I take the Aces and I give them a spin, you're gonna see that one of the Aces goes face down. If I twist it a second time, you'll see a second Ace goes face down. That's two up, two down. If I spin it three times, you'll see that three Aces go face down. And of course, with a fourth spin, the fourth Ace is gonna go from face up to face down. Now, if I spin the packet in the opposite direction, it has the opposite effect. It's gonna cause an Ace to go face up. In this case, it happens to be the Ace of Hearts. That would tell me that the card they selected is a heart. The question, though, is which heart? Could it be the Ten of Hearts? Now, if we get the Ten of Hearts, it might be nice if we go ahead and we get the Jack of Hearts, the Queen of Hearts, the King of Hearts, and the Ace of Hearts to have a perfect royal flush in Hearts. And that's the trick, guys. Hope you like it. It's called maxi twist twist it's by dan fleshman the four ace production at the beginning is called blossom aces by dennis bear